Hey, 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 welcome to this week's Declutter With Me video. I am making over my little office, aka my desk, in my bedroom. And it's bad. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, it's bad. There is currently a shoe on my desk, but that doesn't mean I'm a bad person. It just means I have a messy desk. And welcome to this week's video. My name is Carla. I am going to be doing a makeover on my desk. This is my bedroom we're in right now where all the magic happens. This is where my desk also lives. So it's sort of like my home office area for tax purposes. In this corner is where I'm doing work, except my desk is so messy I never actually work here. I don't sit in the chair because there's piles of papers here. I don't sit at the desk, clearly. There is currently a shoe on the desk. I usually end up sitting on the couch, which I know is probably not good for my body to be practically laying down while I'm on the laptop. So I wanna make this space into something productive, organized, streamlined. I wanna be a person who's on top of her-ish. It's gonna require some major changes. One of the problems is I don't have the desire to open mail. <laughs> One of my big problems is I don't open mail. Even when I do open mail, I do nothing with it. I just look at it like, oh my God, and then I put it away. I need to figure out a system. I need to declutter. I need to get rid of papers. I need to set up organization. I have two drawers that I'm working with and a basket. Two drawers and a basket to organize everything that I need to function as an adult, supposedly. I am gonna also be giving this desk a makeover. The top of the desk has been ruined. Um, I dyed some hair on the desk don't do that. Don't dye hair on a white desk because it will not, the dye won't come off the desk. Rude. I'm thinking marble contact paper. Hopefully that will cover a multitude of sins. We'll see if it works. And if so, I'll have a nice shiny marble looking countertop. I'm going to make it pretty. I'm going to make it pretty and organized. Let's get started. Let's see how it goes. Oh, before we begin, I have to say thank you to the 1000 subscribers. Oh, welcome back if you've been at my channel before. And if you're new, I hope you will click the subscribe button. Join the community. Let's do this together getting our lives mm, upgraded to the next level. Okay, happy to have you here. Let's get started. Yay. This is where we begin. You'll see I have a lot of unopened mail, a lot of papers, a lot of miscellaneous stuff. Every declutter begins the same way. It is imperative that I touch everything. That's just the way it goes. If I don't touch something, I don't know it's there. So right now I'm cleaning the desk off and I'm using my bed as the clean platform to create categories. So what I do is I grab one item at a time and I start to group similar items together. Just in this one little space, I probably had 15 to 20 different categories. I found hair stuff, lots of notebooks, lots of planners, unopened mail, paper, magazines, home decor, tech stuff. There was stuff that belongs in the bathroom, stuff that belongs in the closet, stuff that belongs in the hallway, storage, knickknacks, pens, pencils, stationery, cards, books, notebooks, masks, trash, boxes. You name it, we got it. It's all hanging out on this desk. Oh, here's the desk. There's the hair dye. This thing I never figured out how to put on properly. It's always been broken. There's a bunch of dirt down there, so I'm gonna clean the desk off now. Planner. This one I'm keeping. This planner I do not like at all. I don't need it. I'm getting rid of this. Do I really need this one? I'm getting rid of this one as well. Oh my god, I'm down to one planner. I don't need these anymore. Should I keep one? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm down to three notebooks. Thank you cards. I wish I was a person who sent thank you cards. I would love to be that woman, but I bought these and 
then I never mailed them out. You never got a thank you card from me. Here's where they are. I'm gonna give these away. Envelopes, I actually do use these labels and stickers, so I'm going to keep that. Boom, these give away. I am going to sort through my papers and mail now. Oh my God, all right. Here's my plan for paperwork and mail. The opening the mail isn't the hardest part, it's all the actions that are required after I open the mail. So what I'm doing here is just sorting through it one piece at a time and creating a massive to-do list of what needs to be done. Papers. I have a bag of stuff to shred, a bag of random stuff to give away. Everything from pencil baggy to glass bowl to baby stapler, extra highlighters, markers, envelopes. It's a crab bag. This is a bag of just straight up ugh, trash, old notebook, broken paper tray, things like that. I'm keeping all of these. All of these. Yes. So these things that are on the desk are things that I actively use. I did get rid of that Alexa mini speaker because I already have a Google mini and I don't need both. I'd say 90% of these tech pieces I use. Cables, cords, I already did a big declutter of cables and cords that were unwanted. This I'm gonna put in my purse to recycle. This I'm gonna put in my storage closet. I'll be back. The marble contact paper was super easy to apply. I just didn't get any footage of it. I have a new desk. <laughs> I think it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. I'm gonna to run to Trader Joe's to get some flowers so I can style the desk, make it pretty, and carry this trash down, and I'm done. I'm done. I think it looks, I think it looks pretty good. Hey guys, good morning. It's Friday and I am sitting at my desk like a real professional and it feels so good. It really, really does. I just like how streamlined it is. I realized that the only thing I need are my laptop, my notebook, and my planner and pens. The printer is in the bedroom closet. It's wireless and I don't use it that often. I don't want it taking up the precious real estate on this desk. With papers, I ended up putting a lot of the papers into two filing folders that I had and the rest that need to be processed are in this drawer. The fact that I can actually sit here and work is a miracle. I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy with it. Let me know how you handle paper clutter, what you your desk looks like. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, get notified, follow me on Instagram, download my workbook. It's a free declutter guide. Okay. Have a great day, you guys. Bye.